New York Post had this article. Not that I read New York Post. <laughs> but mm-hmm. New York Post had this article about uh, a Japanese trend that's going on where the Japanese men, not all of them, but this subculture, I guess, has these uh, anatomically correct dolls. Like sex dolls. But like whole women looking okay. dolls, right? Whole women looking dolls. <laughs> and, and they, they don't blow them up. They stay. That they can have they sex stay. with. Like, 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 like if you had a cabbage patch, but a cute. Japanese one, big life size, life size doll. They have a life size doll that you know the mouth or whatever it works, all the stuff works. And they say that they do this and they have these dolls because the women won't do what they want them to do sexually. Or right. not even that. And not just sexual. Yeah, it's not just sexual. It's just like, you know, they're not providing for all of their needs. And so this. But why would you have the doll? The but doll. What else? The doll can't speak and the, the doll, to the mo- go to the movie. But no, there's one particular man that they, they pointed out. One um, one particular. Okay. One <laughs> no, no, no. There's, there are many men who are doing this. But one man in particular mm-hmm. that um, another article had, uh, they, they talked to one of the guys and he said, you know, I, I took one look at her, the doll. And fell in love with the doll. He was in love with the doll, and he said, "Listen, what, this is what he said. This is quotes. Japanese women are cold-hearted. They're very selfish. Men want someone to listen to them without grumbling when they get home from work. So Miss Doll, pro, you know, provides silence. Right? Whatever problems I have, quote, Mayu, he named her, is always there waiting for me." I love her to bits and want to be with her forever. I can't imagine going back to a human being. I want to be buried with her and take her to heaven. Well, that man's crazy, first of all. So we don't want to talk about this all of y'all. Because Kizzy will always find a no, crazy person. That's a crazy person. That's a crazy man. That's a crazy man. No, but there are other men in here who have multiple dolls. In fact, there's another guy. It wasn't just him. So what they have in a, a doll... Orgy? No. What had happened was with this other guy, he had multiple dolls, and he doesn't live. He doesn't. He's actually. But you not have married. to look at these men. He's not actually. Look at them. He. This man is my size. <laughs> okay, sorry. Go ahead. He's not married. He he has a girlfriend, and he just likes the dolls. He feels like it's kind of like a hobby, like NASCAR. He's like you know, some people collect Lamborghinis. But does he have sex with the dolls? Of course he does. There are multiple sex dolls. Okay, so he can, so as long as he not like the crazy man falling in love with him, <laughs> you can have multiple sex toys. Okay, so okay, so so answer me this: If a man is married and he has a sex doll, is that cheating? Uh, absolutely not. If a woman is married and she has a dildo, <laughs> is that cheating? No, but, it's not. But he's taking her out. He's neglecting his wife. And he says that. He's like, I don't I don't even really I don't even need human relationships. I can just be with this doll and that's be good. the crazy man though. We can't we're not talking about the crazy man, we're talking about the story in general. Like calm on Kizzy. Now you can, no, I'm, he is you not, don't be mad at me for what the I'm man not, is doing. I'm not, I'm not all I'm saying is first of all first of all, this is the question. The question is, what's this notion, right? And and I hear people saying that that women are not doing what their husbands want them to do. Like that used to be a thing that you just had to obey your husband, yeah. right? But now it's I don't feel I don't feel like that's a thing anymore. I don't feel like that's a thing anymore either. And I think that these men are doing a great disservice to their relationship instead of working on the relationship with their wife and trying to figure out well what it is. Because he was saying after the kid we stopped having sex and that means well, Steve sad, Harvey blah, blah, blah. says Steve Harvey said men oh, all they want you to do is have sex with them, feed them, and uh, and uh, shut up, right? And this so is what he's saying. He's like, it. he's talking about... They can't yeah, feed you, though. Can't feed you, can't, can't do anything. Out. And he's basically starting this emotional affair with... <laughs> he's really not, though, because it's a dog. But no, no, dildo no. Is not, you're not, you don't no, fall no, in love with them. No, no, but that's the thing is, you don't, take, you don't take them out. You don't take them out in the street. Take it on vacation. Exactly. <laughs> Which is what he's doing. He's taking them out on dates and going out. I would take a sex toy here. on... On, on, I not would take it on vacation. In, in vacation, it's, it's in the room. It's not out in a girl. You, he's doing that though, and he's me. ignoring his You're wife. You're talking about the crazy one man, but I'm <laughs> but, talking about. Listen, the whole thing is, I think that they should focus on the one that they're with to make that stronger. Now, the guy with the lamp who's thinking, oh, it's like a Lamborghini, I just collect them. If he wants to have a bunch of sex dolls and his girlfriend's fine with it because she's kind of like grudgingly accepted it, 
that's a different story. That is like the dildo or the porn or whatever else. Yeah. But for this, people who are literally saying this gives me, provides me with something my wife doesn't, they have an issue. But and they need to like do, but think about a work dog, it out. Right. So some people like animals and stuff give them love and affection and that that people don't give. Right? I don't mm. know. I don't know. Mm. I don't know. I yeah, this is yeah. I don't know. So if you're if okay, one last question. So if you're a man brought a sex doll home a whole doll a whole doll first of all we live in new york i know i have a room for the whole doll where's she going where is this going where is this going to be <laughs> where's she going she's going to be in the bed with y'all three y'all she's not going to be in the bed with us that's silly i'll mess around i'll be messing with her <laughs> come home her wig be twisted <laughs> you stupid Girl, you crazy. <laughs> he gonna be mad at you.